All right, for this screencast, we are gonna do an example, single, our first order integration problem. So on paper here, I'm gonna do this in comments. I have that IXX times P dot is equal to Q infinity times CLDD plus Q infinity times CLP times P. Now, all of these variables, IXX is the moment of inertia. So here, let's do this. IXX is, I'm gonna say five, is the moment of inertia. Um, Q infinity, I'm gonna say is two, is the dynamic pressure. Um, CLDD is, I'm gonna say 0 0.3, is our roll production coefficient. So these are all constants, so it's no big deal. CLP is our is negative zero point two, is our roll damping term. Now this equation up here is the equation for the roll rate of a projectile. All right, and I pulled this from my aerodynamics textbook. Now first we have to put the equation in first order form. So to do that, it's, it's almost in first order form. All we need to do is divide by IXX. So P dot is equal to Q infinity divided by IXX times CLDD plus Q infinity times CLP divided by IXX times P. And that's it. So we have everything we need to find the numerical solution. Um, I derived the Atlantic an, uh, analytical solution for you. Um, and I will provide this to you if you need it. But the analytical solution for P is okay. The analytical solution for P is P zero plus CLDD over CLP times EXP raised to the Q infinity tilde times CLP times T minus CLDD over CLP. Okay, so I defined a few things in here. I said Q infinity tilde is Q infinity divided by IXX, and then P zero, I'm gonna say that P zero is zero. So we have no roll rate right now, and we launched the projectile out. All right, so what do I need? I need to plot T comma P, I'm gonna do x label time, y label roll rate in radians per second. And I'm gonna throw a hold on in here. I'm gonna make a legend roll rate. I'm going to, I need t, t is zero, time step 10. Let's say time step equals 0 0.01. That's a good time step. And I think I got it. Uh, let's do a grid. Grid on. All right, so there's our roll rate. It ramps up. It doesn't look like we simulated long enough. Let's do 100 seconds. Oh my gosh, what happened? Let's go back. F5. Uh, let's throw a close all. And a clear and a CLC. All right, cool, there we go. So there's our roll rate, it starts at zero and it ramps up to 1.5. Okay, so how do we obtain the numerical solution? So numerical solution is what? So we have it, we already have it here in first order form. So it's, I'm just going to copy this, place it here. And then I need four IDX equals one to length of time. And then I have, there's my P dot. And then I have P1 is P0, and I'm gonna do PI1 equals PI plus P dot times time step. So here's my Euler integration. I need to step my state. So I have PI equals PI1. I need to initialize PI equals P0. I'm gonna pre-allocate so I'm gonna say that P ends for numerical is zeros, one comma length of T. I'm then here I need to save my state. 
pn idx equals what? pi. Okay? And that's that should be it. So now we do hold on plot t comma pn r dash dash line width comma two. Let's make this line width comma two. And that should be it. Didn't like it. Let's see. Assignment, number of elements in B must be the same. Okay, so we, in this equation here, it's PI, and that should, oop, that should be it. There we go, so look at that. So there's our analytical solution and our numerical solution. We didn't add it in the legend, uh, numerical solution. Okay, so if I do example Euler, bam. So now, if, as we did in class, if I change my time step, to say 0 0.1 looks still looks good let's do 0 0.5 starting to look a little bad 0. There we, 0 0.9 let's do one so this system is different it looks like it converges a lot better it's slower than the other system so we're allowed to make our time step a lot bigger now we're actually seeing some error in my time step so I have a time step of 20 okay now we're actually starting to see um, some difference here in our in our solution and that's because our speed the speed of our system is different let's try 50 okay let that it looks like that's starting to blow up okay so it looks like here we can totally do two seconds and our error is not very large okay good luck